You can also find, um, what the hell am I looking for, Mike? Greek salad, grilled pitas. So delicious, so nutritious. Greek salads, most often, really boring. Not this one because we're grilling everything in a grill pan. Throw these right into the pan. And we just give them a brush down. And these are gonna serve as our, uh, as our base for the rest of the grilled salad. So um, after that goes in. All right, again, just about a minute on each side. These are good to go. And then we're gonna add our cotija. This is grilled cheese on a whole new level. We're reinventing terms here. And uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna start to look on the side for when the black starts to creep up there. And that's how we know it's ready to flip. We're not there yet. Oh, baby, Mike. Come on. So that's what you're looking for. This is also gonna add a little bit of crispy to the salad. It's almost like a cheese-based crouton. Mm. Our cheese is probably ready to go here. So I'm gonna lift this off. Yeah, that's what we're looking for. Okay. We're adding our cherry tomatoes next. This is right out of the container. We're gonna let those sizzle on there and blacken in spots. Just kind of move them around. You're gonna wait until you start to see little black bits appear on them. In the meantime, sorry, I hope you guys can keep up here. We're just gonna chop this up in the smallish cubes. And then we're gonna add these to our uh, salad bowl. We're already starting to build our bowl. We're gonna throw our cukes in here. We're gonna throw our red onion in here. Kalamata olives, salty and wonderful. Pop those in. I'll get my gingerbread oven mitt on. And we're gonna throw these in the bowl. Last but not least, we're gonna grill up the lettuce. Now this is probably not necessary, but hang on, I got I a call here. Let's see who this is. Hello? Yeah, this is Paul. Hey, look, these are ready to go. You might be asking yourself, why the hell would you grill Romaine. Well, first of all, if you're an adventurous eater, you will realize that anything grilled is better than not grilled. Whew, smoky. This includes grilled romaine. It keeps its crispness, but it gets that smokiness that everybody loves from the grill. So um, we're just gonna add this to the salad, to the rest of what's jonesing in there. And um, we just have some fresh oregano here. If you can't find it, fresh parsley works. Freshly cracked pepper. A couple pinches of sea salt. Bring those flavors together. So um, this is a finishing olive oil. It's different than a cooking olive oil. It's got a lot of great flavors. The cap is really difficult to get off. <laughs> and um, we're just gonna give it a little, little glug there. And uh, then we're just gonna toss. Now, I like the pitas with this, not only because it adds a little bit more substance, but because you could stuff it into the pockets if you want to and kind of make it an impromptu sandwich, like make an impromptu sandwich party, which is the best kind of party. <music> Shove it in here, get enough of the good stuff. You know, one of those guys, and you just chow. It's good without the pita, just like straight up. Sorry, mom. Sorry, mom. But um, this makes it a lunch. Damn.